The Ophthalmic Biophysics Center is a um, basic and transitional science laboratory specializing in bioengineering, biophysics, laser, optics, and drug delivery system, and uh, many other things. We are engineers, our background is engineering. Uh, it might seem not related to ophthalmology, but in fact it is. So what we do, we develop uh, a lot of devices for ophthalmology, ranging from the smallest um, instrument for intraocular surgery or uh, very sophisticated lasers, and uh, I take care of uh, developing new advanced uh, imaging technology for diagnosis in the eye. I develop in particular a technology that is called optical coherence tomography. You can think of it as a micro CT scan uh, for the eye that enables to see the eye in three dimensions, enables to see the eye, what's happening inside the eye in fine details, almost a cellular level, and without touching and without arming the eye. As engineers, we build this technology. As researchers, we use it to study ocular disease in uh, animal models or uh, human beings, and eventually we provide this technology to eye doctor that they can use it for having a direct impact on patient care. Uh, for example, um, a patient can uh, use one of our uh, instrumentation, a doctor can have the patient sitting in front of it, and in two seconds they can take a three-dimensional picture of the whole eye and they can exactly see where the problem is. And by doing so, they can uh, perform early diagnosis of disease, they can better monitor the disease progression, and they can even um, assess the clinical efficacy of new pharmaceutical therapy. Using this technology, they can really decrease the morbidity of the disease and they can improve the quality of life of patients. Transitional research uh, is really important and uh, at the Ophthalmic Biophysics Center we are really we really emphasize transitional research and we believe is one of our strengths. Um, transitional research is concerned with the application of what we learn in the laboratory to the diagnosis and treatment of eye disorders. On one side we have basic science which is expanding knowledge at a phenomenal rate through uh, experiment on model organism or uh, investigation on um, animal models of ocular disorder or in my case uh, advancement of uh, imaging technology. On the other side, translating like the knowledge that we acquire in the laboratory to clinical application that can have direct impact on patient can be really complicated and it can be uh, really unpredictable and slow. So it's important for us to make this process of translating um, knowledge from basic science from the bench to the bedside uh, quick, predictable and also easy so that we can directly benefit uh, eye care of patients.